I don't know if there's any other ingredient, an ingredient like salt that you can add to something where it doesn't have such a massive impact. It creates kind of a backdrop for you to work against. My name is Eric Korsh at North End Grill. This is an episode of Bending the Rules. I use salt in very specific ways in order to capture desired outcomes. When you think about salting a piece of fish like this and then smoking it, it's really a six day process. And for two weeks we have it sitting in that salt and it just sheds all this excess moisture. That, that skin that is created over the next 48 hours of air drying creates a layer in which the cold smoke is going to adhere. So once we have our, our piece of smoke stable, we then cut some nice slices out of it. We make really thin, lacy potato latkes. Um, and we serve it with sour cream and pickled onion, the smoked sable, and a little bit of caviar, and some dill. And so that's what we're gonna make. All right, so we're gonna grate the potato, put it in a paper towel like this, and then we squeeze all the excess water out of it. Okay, so then you've got this like very dry grated potato. I'm gonna put them right into the chicken fat, no seasoning whatsoever. And there's really not a lot of times that you will add no salt to something. I generally think that it interferes with how crispy you can get your potato. You've got kind of two components out of this dish that are pretty salty. Um, you have the smoked fish itself, the pickled onion and the sour cream has a kind of cooling quality to it. You have the caviar, which is also something that's been salted. You know, within the profession of cooking, there is an objective level of seasoning. Salt is the one constant. This is our smoked sable and potato latke appetizer with caviar and sour cream here at North End Grill. I hope you like it.